Hi, I'm Brian Laux, exercise physiologist and program coordinator of the Cardiac and Pulmonary Rehab Program here at Charles Regional Medical Center. We're going to talk a little bit about deep breathing, or it's also called diaphragmatic breathing. The diaphragm is a little cone-shaped muscle right here below your lungs, which helps to expand your rib cage. Typically, with normal breathing, this muscle is active. Sometimes, whether it be to chronic lung illness, pneumonia, or another postural issue, the diaphragm doesn't always function as properly, allowing you to get a deep breath. Today, I'm gonna to walk you through how to do diaphragmatic breathing. That way you can get a good deep breath and know how to do it correctly. The first thing we wanna do is we wanna sit up nice and straight in our chair. We wanna put one hand just above the belly button or right around there below the rib cage. We're gonna take another hand and we're gonna place it right here across our chest or our sternum. What we wanna focus on is as we breathe in, we're gonna breathe in through our nose, pushing our hand outward, the bottom hand. We should not see any rise in the top hand. We wanna breathe in through our nose and breathe out through our mouth. We're gonna breathe in at the count of two seconds and breathe out to the count of four. It should look something a little bit like this. Now you'll notice, as I was breathing, the bottom hand was going out and coming in. That means I'm getting a big belly full of air and I'm doing it correctly because my diaphragm is working. Again, as you're doing this breathing, you should not see the hand on the chest rise. It should be the bottom hand the whole time. Thank you for watching this video. Again, my name is Brian Laux, and please look forward to other videos we have coming soon.